Okay, so we will go ahead and see some concentration units. So what's concentration is, it's the amount of solute present in a given quantity of solvent or solution. So the most common one we have learned in previous classes, that is molarity, which is represented by uppercase M. So the formula for that one is moles of solute divided by liters of solution. I have explained the problem solving on this one in the previous video. So I'll be concentrating in this video the other concentration units such as molality, which is represented by the lower case M. And the formula will be moles of solute divided by mass of solvent. Okay, not the solution, mass of solvent only, but the unit should be in kilogram. Okay. So other two concentration units are percentage by mass, which is nothing but mass of solute divided by mass of solute plus mass of solvent times 100 because it is percentage. And the next one is mole fraction. Mole fraction is moles of solute A divided by sum of moles of all components. Some portion divided by total because that is how it is fraction means, right? Okay, so we will go ahead and see one at a time. So the first question, let us see. Let us go ahead and solve the question based on the given information here. So what are the information given here? So first, we will see what is the molality. So the small letter M of a solution in which five moles of NaCl is dissolved in 2.5 kilograms of water. It's a straightforward question. They gave you the number of moles and they gave you the mass of sol solvent, which is Two point five kilogram. No conversion required or anything here. Straightforward question. So molality equal number of moles of solute divided by mass of solvent in kilogram. So what is the number of moles of solute? It is given as five. And what is the mass of solvent given? It is two point five. So that will equal two molal solution. We read it as molal. We can write it as 2m. So straightforward question. Let's see another one. So the next question is, what is the molality of a solution in which 46 grams of NaCl is dissolved in 2000 kilograms of what? So what is given here is mass of solute is given. Mass of solute equal 46 grams and the solute is NaCl. So then they have given the mass of solvent, which is 2000 kilogram. Okay, so then we have to calculate molality. We know the formula number of moles of solute divided by mass of solvent in kilogram. So we don't have the number of moles directly given. So what I have to do, we have to find the number of moles of NaCl with the given mass. So we know the moles equal mass over molar mass of sodium chloride. So mass is 46, molar mass is 22.99 times 35.45 that will equal so that equal 46 divided by 58.44 that will equal 46 divided by 58.44 equal 0 0.787 moles so what I will do now, I can substitute molality equal number of moles is 0 0.787 divided by 2000. So that equal divided by 2000 
that equal 3.9 935 so I will just take two sig fix so 3.9 times 10 to the power negative 4 molal solution so molality molality that's how you can solve if the number of moles are not directly given let's try another problem here how much water should be added to 5 grams of kcl to prepare 0 0.5 molal solution so what is given here is mass of solute which is 5 grams and we know the solute is kcl and it is molality is also given which equals 0 0.5 m okay so we know molality equal number of moles divided by mass in kilogram for the solvent okay so what we have to do we have to convert that grams into moles so 5 divided by potassium is 39.10 and chlorine is 35.45 so that divided by mass in kilogram we don't have that's what we are trying to find okay so that equal 5 divided by 39.1 plus 35.45 that equal 74.55 divided by mass in kilogram that equal 5 divided by 74.55 that equal 0 0.067 divided by mass in kilogram okay so now we have to isolate the molality is given okay so that is molality is 0 0.5 that equals 0 0.067 divided by mass in kilogram so what we will do we can simplify that one by multiplying on both sides by mass in kilogram and mass in kilogram and so we can cancel mass in kilogram from this side right and then what we need mass in kilogram on the left side so i don't want 0.5 on the left side so divided by 0.5 and divided by 0.5 okay so what we can cancel from the left side 0.5 and 0.5 so now i can simplify that one mass in kilogram equal 0 0.067 divided by 0 0.5 that equal I have 0 0.13 and how many sig fig I should have 3 1 3 4 kilograms of water that's how we can calculate Here is another question. Calculate the molality of a sulfuric acid solution containing 24.4 grams of sulfuric acid in 198 grams of water. And also it is given the molar mass of sulfuric acid. So we don't have to calculate by ourselves. So what we can do here is uh, just write the formula and substitute. Um, first find the number of moles here, right, using this molar mass and the mass given and then convert that grams into kilogram that's all we have to do okay so we know molality equal number of moles of solute divided by mass of solvent in kilogram so number of moles i am going to do it directly here 24.4 divided by 98.4 0.9 that divided by convert that 
grams of water into kilograms of water by dividing with a thousand. So that equals 0 0.249 divided by 0 0.198. That will give you 1.26 molar solution. And now try this question by yourself or check for understanding. And uh, next slide, you can see the answer for this question.